hello everyone in this video we will learn case 2 of projection of straight line this case is line inclined to vp and parallel to hp in the previous video we have seen line inclined to hp and parallel to vp opposite of that is line inclined to vp and parallel to hp if i hold line inclined to hp sorry vp see this line is inclined to vp because it in it is making certain angle with vertical plane and it is parallel to horizontal plane okay why we say this line is inclined to vp because if you consider each and every point on this line these points are at different distance from vertical plane that's why this line is making certain angle with vertical plane whereas if you consider each and every point on this line with respect to horizontal plane it is making uh, sorry uh, all these points are at same distance from horizontal plane therefore this line is parallel to hp if i want to draw its front view and top view what i am supposed to do i have to just project the end points of this line on vertical plane and i get these two points a dash and b dash if i join these two ends i get front view it will be of some short length because this line is making some angle with vertical plane to get its top view what i am supposed to do i have to project ends of this line on horizontal plane to get its top view and this end is a this end is b the top view notations are small a and small b the front view notations are a dash and b dash that two small letters okay these are the two views what's happening here as line is parallel to what is uh, sorry horizontal plane we are getting true length in the top view and the same angle we get here whereas in front view we get the reduced length or short length in front view as it is making the line is making certain angle with vertical plane here we have drawn uh, the sketch in uh, isometric view but if you want to draw orthographic views of this uh, orthographic views of this line that is front view and top view on 2d plane we get a dash b dash as a front view and a b as top view with inclination and true length uh, this is very easy to understand by referring this model okay i have made some model this is vertical plane this is horizontal plane this uh, line is common to both the planes that is reference line x y after holding this line parallel to horizontal plane and inclined to vp we get top view uh, with true length and we get front view with short length see after drawing the projections we are, but we are supposed to do we have to rotate the horizontal plane through 90 degree in the clockwise direction so as to make both the views available in 2d plane front view a dash b dash and top view a b with true length and inclination this is true length okay I hope you must have understood the concept, the simple concept of line inclined to VP and parallel to HP. Thanks for watching. We will go for some another cases that is line is in VP inclined to HP, line is in HP inclined to VP, line parallel to both planes, line is in both planes. After covering all these uh, cases, uh, we will go to oblique line that is line inclined to both the planes. In this case, case 1 and case 2, the line is inclined to one plane and parallel to other. Thank you.